Perarubis, they're recycling two tons of cell phones. Some of them real relics from the dawn of the industry. For production chief Detlev Laza, the vintage models are merely a source of raw materials. A phone like this is made up of 10 to 15 percent copper, but if you take a look at the contacts, you can see there's gold too. A ton of phones contains up to 300 grams of gold, plus two to two and a half kilos of silver. That's what interests us. If you break it down into the precious metals and other valuable parts, it's worth some nine to ten thousand euros. The company recycles all sorts of electronics, including computers, TVs and mobile phones, for their lucrative components. It's our source of metal. We don't have mines or mineral deposits. For us, it's urban mining. We extract the metals needed for our economy, for our industry, and make them re-available for production processes. The problem is that very few consumers know how valuable their used cell phones actually are. A number of companies have now sprung up, offering people cash for their old cell phones. This firm buys up around 8,000 units a month. In some cases, the phones are just months old. The company's dealings with customers take place entirely on the Internet. Customers get an estimate for their phone online. A relatively new smartphone is worth between two and three hundred euros. If the device still works, the data is wiped and the device is refurbished and sold to a new owner. A sales transaction on our website takes three to four minutes. All you need to do is package the phone and mail it free of charge. We transfer the money within seven days. And it's a far more dependable option than the online auction sites where you never know what's going to happen. The average household in Germany has two or three old phones gathering dust. The financial incentive means more of them are now finding their way back into circulation. And if they can't be used anymore for their original purpose, they're likely to end up at Arubis. It's the only company in Germany that melts down shredded phones to produce raw copper. Copper has never been so much in demand on the world markets or so expensive. And that demand would be difficult, if not impossible, to meet without recycling electronic scrap. Arubis processes around a million tons of copper per year. That's an anode with a copper content of around 98%. There's also all the base metals like nickel and lead, plus the precious metals gold, silver and palladium. We then extract and refine pure copper via electrolysis. Electrolysis is the final step in the recycling process. The metal is placed in a bath of sulfuric acid and a powerful electric current is passed through it. The result? Sheets of copper with a purity of 99.9 percent.